Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome to race number three. This is gonna be a tr it's gonna be a treacherous race. It's gonna be on the wall, slide or die, and not in a good way. <laughs> oh well, let's see what happens. Maybe the top will get run in so much that the bottom might come back in. Maybe we'll get multiple grooves. Well, there, I don't know, the bottom's there, but it's just, it seems to be a little bit off. Right now we're quick time, but not everybody's gone. All right, so we qualified pole. Got quick time, that's cool. So, good start. Now we just gotta finish it. Spun my tires on the start, and it cost me the lead. Right now I'm just trying stuff, following him ain't gonna do no good, and when we get to the feature, we're gonna wanna pass, we're gonna have to figure out something to do. That's not good, that was lucky. Whoa! Pretty sure that dude ran out of fuel. Pretty sure he ran out of fuel. All right, here we go. Let's get a good start here. Jeez. I 
And we're broke. I don't know what happened there. Not every one of these 200 races is going to be flawless, you know, flawless winner. Things happen. Well, now we'll just see what we can salvage out of it. The car's definitely broke. I've got, it says I've got wheel damage. Damage on the front end, damage on the rear. So the whole car's damaged. One of the good things, though, about the midgets is, is that they, they can still drive pretty well, even with damage. So... I'm going to wait for these guys to clear out a little bit. Bottom feels pretty good if you can hit it, but obviously we haven't had enough laps here to, to see if it's going to be worth anything. The top is just really fast right now. Off the wall there, Brody. My car feels a little too broke to be up top, man. I don't know what wheel is damaged, but probably the right rear feels like because it's vibrating like crazy up here, and it's like the car just wants to spin. Let's go to the bottom and see what we can salvage out of this race. Definitely faster on the bottom with the broken car. Or I should say this broken car. Obviously I'm not always faster on the bottom with the broken car. <laughs> So freaking patient with the throttle.
So considering we came, we had to go to the end of the pack at the start of the race, that's pretty good. This race is almost over. I really just want to fit. If I can put this on the podium after getting wrecked, I'll be so happy. Considering my car is still broke. I think I did put it on the podium. Sweet. I will take it. All right, you guys. So thank you very much for joining me here for another race in our BC 202. Um, 200 races in two months. Uh, basically running pretty much everything. Asphalt oval, dirt oval, as you just seen. So thank you guys very much. If you would like to check out the charities that uh, we are doing this for, um, Links are down in the description below. It's BC Legacy Fund, which is Driven to Save Lives. We're on the Driven to Save Lives website. And then also the uh, Daniel Coppercino Foundation, um, which is for drug and alcohol addiction. You know, you guys know my story and my my recovery. And that one just kind of hit home a little bit. So those are our, our links down in the description below. And so, yeah, if you want to check out any of those, uh, donate to them pledge anything like that links are down in the description below so thank you guys very much for joining me and if you want to make sure that you catch more of these races because we got a whole lot more coming uh, make sure to to you know subscribe hit that notification bell and then also you can join me for live streams and stuff like that because i'll be doing a lot of that as well during these next two months that this is going to be going on so thank you guys very much i really appreciate it and until next time, as always, I want to wish you good luck, good racing, take care.